guys, it's Cam and Katie and today we're back with another 10 Irish names. As we've already announced on our channel, we are currently pregnant. So as you can imagine, we've been thinking a lot about names and the meaning of names. So we thought it would be good to do another 10 Irish names video. Our last one has been getting a lot of support. So yeah, you guys seem to be liking it. So we figured why not do another one? Because there's plenty of Irish names to go around. So Yes. And they are so hard to pronounce when you look at them. So Cameron is going to elaborate on how to pronounce them. I saw the list. I have no idea how to pronounce any of them. So they should be fun. And then I'm going to explain what they mean. Mm -hmm. Should we get started? Let's do it. Okay, wait. So this first one, you guys see it. Ophi. Ophi. <laughs> Stop. What is it? Aoife. 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 A-O-I in Irish makes an E noise. So okay. Aoife. Um, I don't think there is an English name to this. I've never heard. Correct me if I'm wrong down in the comments, but I'm pretty sure this is just a straight Irish name. Okay. Aoife. It's a girl's name. Aoife, not Ophi. Aoife Ophi. <laughs> means beautiful, radiant, and joyful. Huh. Interesting. I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. All right. I'm teaching him too. So. Yeah. All right. Name number two. Are you ready? Neem. Neem. What? Neem. Neem. Yeah. That yeah, was close. Neem. Ne Wait. What? M H. I've said this in uh, other videos. I think M H and B H in Irish make a V sound. So if you have M H, it's V. So, so say Niamh. it again. Neve. 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 Yeah. I don't. Again, I don't think this. I think this is just an Irish name. I don't think there's an English version. Um, and there's a very famous story about Neve Kinor, which is a Irish legend. Stick around, and one day you'll find out what that Irish legend's all about. Ooh. <laughs> so that means radiance, luster, or brightness. Another one so I didn't know. Irish names have lots of very symbolic meanings, but mm -hmm. unless you look it up, it's not like, there's some Irish names where literally you can it's tell. It's the word yeah, in the Irish. The word, you know it means X, Y, and Z. But um, some of the Irish names, unless you look them up, you wouldn't really know what exactly it means. So that's good to know. Cool. Cool. Cool beans. Cool. 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 <laughs> All right, name number three for girls. Roisin. Man, this one's an easy one. Roisin. Roisin. Yep, so you got it right, Roisin. Roisin. And the meaning of Roisin is little rose. Interesting. Hmm. Interesting. And it's been used since the 16th century in hmm. Ireland. Learn something new every day. All right, name number four for the Irish girls. Is it Murian? Close. Murian. Murian. Wait, what? Murian. <laughs> Mur like urine? Mur Don't say that. No. <laughs> There's more of a W in there after the M, so it's Murian. Murian. Yeah. That's not That's what actually, we're going to name our child, no, just so you all know. That because is actually, I cannot pronounce yeah, that. That's a lot harder to pronounce than I thought about. Yeah, I guess, like you said, it sounds like urine. No offense to all the Murins out there. But there's more of a W at the start. So it's not Murin, it's Murin. Okay. Yeah, moving on. <laughs> yes. This means sea white or sea fair. Actually, now that I think about it, the word Muir in Irish, M-U-I-R, means like sea. Okay, last but not least for the Irish girl names. <laughs> Sheban. Sheoban. Sheoban. Okay, please stop. You're offending all the Siobhans out Siobhan. there. Siobhan! And Siobhan is the Irish for Joan. How does Joan turn into Siobhan? I don't know. Usually they sound alike, so that one always baffles me too. The meaning of Siobhan is God has been gracious. God's grace, or it can mean full of charm. Huh. 
So interesting. I had no idea. So moving on to five Irish boy names. First and foremost, we have Dermid, Dermude, Dermid. <laughs> Sounds like pyramid. Your first guess was pretty good. What was it? Dermid. Dermid. Yeah. Kind of so, like Deirdre. Yeah. <laughs> wow, good memory. So, Dermot is, sounds very similar, Dermot. You've probably heard of Dermot. Dermot the Hermit. Is that a thing? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I feel like Dermot's a common name in English. Maybe, again, it's like the uh, like a common name in Ireland, but it's the English version. So, I know a Dermot, but I also know a Dermot. Okay, Dermot means without enemy. It has been the name of King's heroes and saints so if you want your child to be the name of a king hero or saint wow dear mid dear mid do, do it do it all right second for the boys we have daithy daithy <laughs> i mean that is how you would pronounce it it's dahi dahi so th in irish and this is again going back to we've talked about this this is why irish people don't well I don't speak for all Irish people, but at least people who know me, a lot of Irish people don't pronounce their THs because there is no TH noise in Irish. TH in Irish, you just pronounce the H. Yeah. So this would be Dahi. Dahi. And Dahi is the Irish for David. All right. And Dahi means swiftness or nimbleness. <laughs> the third Irish name for boys is... <laughs> My guess is Fionn. Close. Fionn. Not close. Fionn. 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 Okay. No. You're not like a race car. Like Fionn. Fionn. <laughs> okay. Stop. <laughs> Fionn. Fion. Okay. Like I'm having Fion. <laughs> Fion in Irish. Fion is the Irish for like blonde. So if someone had blonde hair, they would their hair would be Fion. So oh. Fion means like a blonde hair. So if boy. you give birth to a brunette, you're planning on calling them Fion. Fion. You should probably change the name. Have yeah. a backup plan. I think I don't know if I know any Fions that are brunettes. I probably do. Ooh. That and that means fair-headed, white, or clear. So... Pretty much what I said. Yeah. Name number four. Ryan. A really neat way to spell Ryan. Well, you're right in one way because this is the Irish version of Ryan. I thought so. Ryan. That's, That's cool. That's an Irish Ryan. So this means little king or kingly. And how do you say king in Irish? Yeah, that would make sense because king in Irish is re. Or I fada. That's king, so that makes sense. Yep. Cool beans. Cool, cool beans, beans. Cool beans. We save the best for last. Kaimin. <laughs> okay, this name is Quivin. Quivin. Which is the Irish for Kevin. So in Home Alone, when she goes, Kevin! Kevin! In the Irish, in the Irish translation version, Quivin! <laughs> I love him. This is a really good name to name a child. It means handsome, beautiful, gentle, kind, honest, and gentle birth. Wow. That... I mean, if you're going for a really symbolic name that means a lot of good things, go with this one. Quivian's the way forward. Yes, for sure. Thank you for bearing with me as I learned how to pronounce these very difficult 10 Irish names. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> and Cameron, thank you for teaching us. Make sure to watch our last video where we did 10 unique Irish names and then that way you will know 20. <laughs> so yeah, be sure to check out our other video about Irish names and of course there's plenty of other Irish videos on our channel if you want to get to know more about Ireland, Irish culture, all of those good things. As always, please comment below any suggestions you guys have. We love when you guys give us suggestions. It's always very helpful for us. Gives us ideas, gives us new things to do. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching. Bye.